Snapshot 18W47B is out now, guys. We have new villages styles coming. We got these villager outposts, and guys, these textures have been overhauled for real. Hey there, guys. Skippy here for Room Skippy 6 Gaming. Guys, coming to you with a snapshot update because we have some additions and some changes. And uh, yeah, for this one here, guys, let's go for 341 likes. If you are one of those dudes, don't forget to hit me up below. So uh, yeah, there has uh, been a there was a snapshot just a day or two ago, or maybe one day. It was on Wednesday. Today is. Uh, Friday so yeah two days ago and uh, yeah there's been some changes in addition to these villager outposts uh, pillager outposts and pillager raids there has been some adaptation of the textures in the game a lot of changes guys very different uh, in addition to that there has been uh a few smaller changes with regards to uh, what goes on in the game so i think uh, what we're gonna do is uh, jump on in guys don't forget to hit my twitter and uh yeah i will put a link to the change log in the description below and we can start this off with the first tweet so the first tweet guys is right here this is from a new person i've never seen uh kojo max i wasn't following him before i guess he works at minecraft and uh, yeah a new snapshot on friday this is ludicrous this is madness this is minecraft snapshot 18w47b go grab it so like i said guys there will be a link to this uh, in the description below and uh, if you want to go check it out yourself that said at the same time that this all came out you know we're gonna look at the new village uh kind of creation design at the end of this because it's not in the snapshot but it was tweeted at the exact same time by lady agnes so uh let's jump into the snapshot uh change log right here snapshot 18w47b today's snapshot nice and peaceful this is basically the same thing uh from yesterday so or from two days ago so basically the snapshot when they come with like 18w47 a b it all comes from the same snapshot they just update this page as they go through the a's b's and c's so uh let's go on to the very next one this is going to tell you all the stuff so uh these top ones is what's changed in the snapshot that's here today this is again on java edition uh numerous world gen performance improvements it was super broken guys when i loaded up this world uh to try to do my video the other time it took like three minutes just to load the area so there was lots adjusted mob spawning behavior to be closer to that of 1.13.2 so uh, there was some changes I guess they didn't like it so they kind of brought it back more Japa texture changes guys it kind of looks like a new game this is starting I said this on the last one I am fond of the changes that Japa is doing I just feel like there has to be a point when you know those are the textures we've reached and not you know like change the textures every single update i love it i want to go for them they look really cool most of them are a win uh, but if you change the textures every single guys we went for like a decade with the same textures and i just feel like there's a sense of recognition that we need to have kind of those things fix strongholds not generating properly reduce the cluster side of villager spawning so outposts aren't flooded by pillagers so i didn't really notice that the first time and uh yeah so the other ones here you guys already saw this on the last video basically they added pillager outposts raids and changed some block textures uh and uh basically if you find a pillager with a banner on his head and then you kill him you're gonna get a bad omen bad omen means they come to your village and uh kill everybody and you if you're there i think so uh yeah that's a pretty interesting one i think last but not least we got the few bug fixes right here uh we'll just do the top ones world generation logs warning empty or non-existent pool minecraft empty blocks appear elsewhere in the world when they update that's yeah wow and uh yeah can't place rails redstone on other blocks that need a solid block below on soul sand pistons are no longer transparent uh so that's weird uh I don't know if that's a thing. Maybe they're not going to be transparent anymore. I know on Bedrock they are. Uh, this is going to be interesting to see. Barrels facing south have rotated uh, front texture. So in addition to that, guys, there's the, the bug fixes from last time. Leeches, shulkers, all that stuff. And uh, yeah, so let's go over here. Let's go back, in, back into the game. But first, we're going to draw this tweet by Lady Agnes. Uh, me and Amazing Prof Morpheus are working on the updated looks of villages. Here is Savannah Village. So I think what we're going to see is you can see this tweet just it came out two hours ago, but I just woke up. So yeah, pretty much at the same time as this as this snapshot came out. 
but you can see it looks a ton different. This is like an acacia village for in a savanna. A savanna village, I guess, is the way that you call it. Let's zoom in on that bad boy. Bang. So you can see we have some really cool structures. These are much different than the usual structures, and I think they're very awesome personally. I like that we're going to have all of these different villages coming in. I think we could likely see this very soon. Uh, I think this falls into the savanna, taiga, and uh, other vote. And basically, those three are all going to get an overhaul. And I think we're going to see Taiga probably all come at once. So they're not going to just sneak peek it. They're going to sneak peek you the Savannah and the Desert, the new villages. I think they're going to sneak peek those soon because we saw the new village Desert. We saw the new Desert Village in the in the first time they released this challenge, right, at Minecon. So we knew that that was there. We saw a few things. Uh, this is the Savannah. So I think in addition, we'll get Taiga's campfires and berries, I guess, or uh, and foxes. Uh, but they're going to release that at one time so let's go into the game here and let's take a look so these are those those outposts i think they're really super cool everybody does everybody's waiting for them it looks like it's not really overrun with pillagers if you ask me i'm not uh i'm not too sure exactly what like what is overrun but this does not the one thing i will say is that this is just reloaded i reloaded yesterday's map uh into today's snapshot so there might not this changes might not take place here because uh they know that this is on uh you know what i mean slash time set day so uh, in addition to this let's go to the textures guys because at first glance guys even just looking around you can see that they are completely different when as soon as i loaded up the world i was like you know what this looks so weird just like everything's so crazy so i think the best way to do this is to actually simply oh looks like there's a village over here and it's a savannah village so uh that's actually perfect proof that you can see that this new village is not uh, the new village style is not in play yet. It's simply an image uh, on Lady Agnes's Twitter, and uh, yeah. So I think uh, I'm not sure what that is. What's that? I heard a weird noise. I guess someone's messaging me. I don't know. And uh, yeah, so let's leave that. Let's do this. This is gonna. Wow, look how cool that is. A temple right in the village so let's go through this way this way guys is the best way to do it just looking through you can see there has been some severe changes look at this even stripped wood now has all I don't know if when they did this but you could tell this is a recent a recent changes but all the strip wood has a different tone and texture uh, the gold and emeralds and diamonds and all of that stuff has been changed drastically as well um, yeah, it's just overwhelming the differences. If you look at this TNT, it looks so much different. But let's get uh, let's get diamonds, and let's get gold. I guess those are the two that are gonna stand out. Even the gold pressure plate here is gonna have that texture. So uh, let's go down here. Like I said, I hope that these textures come to you know a final point at some point in time. It looks like all the fishes are floating on top of the water here. But you could see that. Let's go put this guy down here. I think it looks good. I like it. I know that I noticed that I saw Exuma Void uh, applauding it on Twitter, and he was like, "Yep, that looks good. The gold looks good." So, uh, I mean, we could just get gold blocks right here. I think the gold looks really good too, actually. If I don't, if I do say so myself, it looks really sharp. So, on that note, guys, I think we pretty much got a chance to look at all of this stuff. I'm excited to see what's coming forward to Bedrock and what's coming forward to the other versions like console. I'm still not fond of this block of emerald. Jappa, if you're listening, which you're probably not because you're probably watching a Zuma Voice video, but watch mine. This emerald, I don't get it. I'm not the, I'm not on the same page. I know, I know this might be outside the box thinking, but I'm going to go ahead and tell you something. Why not just make it exactly like the golden diamond? If you are listening, I think if this was green, it would look super cool. They would have continuity and it would be awesome. So uh, on that note, I'll let you guys explore. Like I said, changelog is in the description below. Outposts, new villages coming, new textures, all that good stuff. Thanks a lot for tuning in and I'll catch you on the next one.